Hi, I'm the Dreams Dragon. And here are my favorite non-dreams for July 2022. Uh, Dreams Dragon, what are you doing here? Making a video. Uh, we did a community poll, don't you remember? And 39% said they'd rather I did it. Oh, so they don't want me? Should I go then? You don't need any help from me? Well, no, I think I can do it by myself. Okay, bye then. Okay, bye. Oh, now he's gone. We can have a look at my 10 favourite non-game dreams. These are animations, artwork, music, interactive experiences, anything that doesn't fit comfortably within the game section. So here's July 2022. Well, first up, we have Revenge is a Dish Best Served Gold. And this is a 3D scene with some animation. It's um, a cat in a boat fishing for carp with a dragon in the background. Uh, it's really, really cute. I love the design of this. The style is uh, very kawaii, which I really like. And um, you have some choices here with the camera, but just a couple. Doesn't really make that much of the scene. Uh, but what I really like is the model viewer. There we go. Look at that. Isn't that a cute character? I really love it. And you can spin him around and have a good look at the fish that he's got in his basket. His tail and everything. I think this is so cute. I'd love to see this character in a game. Maybe catching carp. Maybe a fishing game or maybe ca just catching carp, falling carp in his basket or something. Or maybe a platformer with him. Lovely. Uh, we have a model of a rowboat. Again, this uh, plastic toy style. Uh, his basket and uh, fishing rod. All of it looks absolutely beautiful. And here's the koi carp. In that same plasticky style. And there's the golden dragon with movable jaw. Um, he didn't need the back because uh, it was climbing up the waterfall so there is no back end to this dragon but he looks good from the front. So there's our scene. Just zoom back out. There we go. I think it's really cute, really nice and that's by Near Rivers which is a name I'm not familiar with. I'll be looking out for more stuff from them. This next one is an interactive animation by Drico. This combines two of Tom Cruise's biggest hits, Top Gun and Mission Impossible. Um, this is the meme in itself, um, Tom Cruise running. We can make him grin his head off, look. <laughs> right, but we can also give him a bike. So there we are. You can have it in Mission Impossible or Top Gun style. We can zoom in and we can make him go faster. Uh, let's change the angle. Look at that. Look at that nose. Goodness me. And you can look around as well. It is so cool. It's really a lot of fun. That's really funny. Oh, it's a great caricature. You can tell immediately who it's supposed to be. It's a little cruel, but that's what caricatures are. Yeah, lots of fun. Next, we have a little model of a yeti by Tiny Diorama. This is another kawaii-style character model. Uh, it seems to be very popular this month for some reason. I don't know if there was a competition going on, but. Uh, I love this. I think this is very cute. Sort of a model that you might buy and have behind you on a shelf when you're doing YouTube videos. People seem to buy these things. Anyway, this is a cute, cute yeti. Not the sort that t tears your head off. The sort that will playfully throw snowballs at you. I think that's lovely. Here we have Arsini 3D and this is Astro Thumb Stories 2. Uh, this is a series of little comedy skits. 
sort of gross out comedy there's lots of burping and farting jokes but um if you haven't seen astro thumb stories one then uh, don't worry these aren't connected as such but it might be a good idea to introduce yourself to the character by watching the first one first so let's just play one of the skits Greetings, inhabitants of planet Earth. You're always asking me if I ever go outside of my spaceship. Of course I do. Sack smacking the joystick, oh yeah. Some assist. Yes, Captain. Prepare the airlock and ready the observation deck. Then it's gonna go outside. Oh, this is gonna be good. <laughs> Now this is really nice. Wait. Oh, let's see good. Come and come and see. So here we have Bad Robo 82s somewhere in between. Um, this is his first one of the, this, uh, what's going to be a series, I assume. This is called Walk in the Park. Now he teased us with this on Twitter um quite a long time ago now um and people didn't believe uh that this could possibly be made in dreams it looked so realistic um it certainly is at the top level um of realism in in dreams uh bad robo is uh, uh very good at the, the greenery the lighting everything just seems really really realistic If you get up close to things, you can you can t you can tell a little bit more. You don't see the flex and everything, but you know, don't do that. Just wander around and enjoy the realism. I think it's really really great. This. There's ghosts playing in the park. We can't go over there. I don't think. Can we? No. Okay, you have to f let's follow the path. I like the way that um, you get the rustle of the leaves if you're in the leaves and if you're not in the leaves you don't get any. It's very cool. Oh, look at this. We get to the end here and um, there's a portal there but I think that's going to link up to uh, more scenes. Uh, at the moment it's just this. Look at this. There's a lake there, a mountain. Very impressive scenery. Uh, next, I've got Dream Flicks. This is uh, a community collaboration project. Um, I think it's a competition. I'm not 100% sure. It might be just be a challenge uh, for anybody to take part in. I don't know if there's winners or losers, but uh, it's run by uh, Kel Beyones and um, the, the way this works is you're given a prompt list uh, of what the video should contain and then you go ahead and make a, uh, a little animated short and uh, this is probably the best way of looking at it so um, there's lots of animated shorts here I haven't seen all of them I'm just going to pick one at random this happens to be by Kelby Jones so let's play Do you want to see a magic trick? Let me show you a magic trick to pass the time. Class upstairs, and no, I'm not interested in your magic. Unless you know how to make me human. Oh, 
<laughs> Oops. <laughs> Next we have a music video. This is Hyper Pop. Next we have um, an art, it is a game but it's, it's, it's really, uh, it's a colouring book, um, it's a paint by numbers so it's more artistic than, than anything and it allows you to be creative, um, it gives you the colour codes, um, but it doesn't stop you from sw swapping all these around if you want uh, but this is the palette you've got. Uh, in order to colour in. So what you do is you select say R here and you can colour in everything that's R. Select the W there. I can colour in all the Ws. Um, this can be quite relaxing and um, the, the painting itself is excellent so when you um, if you manage to fill this out exactly as, as shown uh, you end up with a really photorealistic result. It looks absolutely amazing of a Bengal tiger. Um, it's going to take you a, a, a while to do this, uh, so it's a sort of a relaxing, casual thing to be doing. Sort of relax and uh, just do a little bit of colouring in. A little bit of clicking and colouring in. Adult colouring books becoming a very popular pastime relatively recently. I don't know why, but it's... Uh, oops. I think that went a bit wrong. I clicked on something too big. Yeah. So you, you can press the clear button and, and click on it again and it will take the... Uh, take the paint away. Anyway, you get the idea. Uh, there's also one of um, Girl with a Pearl Earring, if you want to do that one. Here we have a little French scene. Um, there is a lot of French things being launched into Dreamiverse right now because of the game jam. And um, which is Bon Appetit, hosted by Infinity Dreams, which is the French Dreams community. This is rather nice. Uh, I love the uh, the animations that come out of the posters and 3D objects that are coming out of the walls. Look at that smoking cat. How, how odd is that? But somehow very, very French. The scene isn't very big, but um, it's really nicely done. Everything's slightly at a weird angle. It's got a really nice feel to it. Okay, lastly but not least, we have Dreams Fest 22. Um, this is a music festival. There was one last year, and this is this year's festival. There's plenty for you to do. Uh, there's also games to play and everything, and um, the whole Dreams Festival to explore. Song and uh, each stage has got its own selection of bands playing. This is Mr. Casey Jones. Monday morning here again, 8 a.m. time to begin. Blast from the alarm clock wakes me with a shock. Grab my briefcase, shove toast in my face. Well, that was the best non-games of the month that I chose. Uh, if you want to see my best games of the month, then that is done by the Dreams Dragon, and you'll find that 
um, probably next to this one um, on my on my playlist. And uh, and I've been doing the Dream of Dragon for a few months now, uh, so we're just starting this one off. So you haven't missed any. This is the first one of the non games. So uh, we'll be looking at more artwork and animations and music and other things next month. Hope you join me for that. Uh, there will be a link to the collection in the description. Catch you in your dreams. <laughs>